Hello, it is Wednesday, December 21st, 2011 at 1.56 a.m. Central Standard Time. And I was just on a telecast and noticed these little pink splotches all over. And pink is supposed to be a mixture of rain and snow. However, these, if you go to the frame before and the frame after, well, here they moved and then they disappear. And what I want to show you is I live in this general area and these are locations for wind turbines. I'm not sure about over here though, but these in this area are And when I went over to AccuWeather, they're also showing up there somewhat, not as um, distinct, but yes, yet they are, and they are also pink, which is, again, well, in this case, it's ice. So, I, yeah, I think that would be a mixture of rain and snow. Well, no, they got purple for mixed, okay. So this is saying that it's ice, and if I change it to snow, it's also still showing up as pink, which is ice again. But something I noticed that I didn't notice on a telecast is we've got this beam. It's a beam at, out of St. Louis right here, and it, it usually stays on, although in this case it's not staying on the whole time just a couple of the frames but then there's this and there's another beam this way that should be showing up but it's not but there's this one here that's kind of flashing on and off it's one in between those two when I went to the College of DuPage this is Iowa and, and these are the locations of those the turbines in, in addition there's a whole field that goes across this corner of Minnesota and you can see a beam coming out of Minnesota right there let me slow it down here and there's also a beam coming up here out of Na Hastings Nebraska and that one's aimed at this area right here the one coming out of St. Louis here's the one that's fixed but there's an also another one that comes up and it's aimed more at these and then there's one coming out of Minneapolis that's aimed at, at this field here. So, and this one's moving back and forth. See, there's the one coming out of Minneapolis going backwards. So that's 508 UTC on December 30, 21st. And the ones coming out of Hastings, they're pretty constant, although they're switching around. And this one you can barely see, but it's pulsing. And I'll zoom in on it a little closer. Let me go all the way through the loop here. Okay, let's go look at... Turn it down a little bit so it's not going so fast. and then this the system moves in the way but right there you can see it here's a further out shot and you can see the one coming out of Minneapolis the ones coming out of Hastings and there's this little blue cloud that comes down and once it intersects the Doppler here at Hastings it seems to turn that little beam off let's go look at that Let's get so the time shows too. See right here. Let's zoom in even more. See there it comes. And here's a Doppler right there. Once it hits that, then it turns the beam off. So it must be a signal of some sort or it's carrying a charge of some sort that switches it. 
Let's unzoom here. So we've got three beams, one coming down here affecting this, one coming up here affecting these, and then this one down here pulsing, and that's more of this area over here. I'm not sure what's getting these over here. But earlier tonight I was checking out something for a friend and I ran across this statement. This is um, Open Access Energies ISSN 1996-1073 www.mdpi.com slash journal slash energies it looks like it's from 2009. It's entitled Electromagnetic Interference on Large Wind Turbines. But the very last paragraph said something that I already suspected, but now I actually have seen it in print. Um, this paper represents a general overview on electromagnetic interference with respect to wind turbine related aspects. A wind turbine can act as both a transmitter and receiver of electromagnetic interference. And I take that if, if it can both transmit and receive interference, then it can also transmit and receive electromagnetic waves, which I assume that is interference. It sounds like it. So there's some kind of exchange going on between all of these There's signals being sent out. These are being affected and, and agitated by the waves. What the purpose is, I'm not clear on that yet, but I will keep digging. And if you know anything, please add a comment. Um, God bless you. Have a good rest of the night.